Hey, uh, I'm glad you brought this back with you. <laughs> Outlander just dropped a huge hint about one of the biggest twists coming in Season 8, and there are some surprises in store that nobody will see coming. Plus, we've got the first images from the prequel series, Outlander Blood of My Blood, which connects the future and the past. So, let's dive into what we know about the upcoming Season 8 and its exciting prequel series. First, let's catch up on what's happening with Claire and Jamie in Outlander Season 7 Part 2 to get a clearer picture of what's coming in Season 8. Claire and Jamie's relationship has been strained in Season 7, with Jamie risking his life as a rifleman in the American Revolution. Despite the challenges, they've managed some family time, including a crucial trip to Scotland, though they haven't been able to fully reconnect due to the tumultuous historical period. Their love for each other remains strong, and they hold on to hope despite their precarious situation. From the images released, it looks like Claire and Jamie are determined to survive their current predicament even if it means confronting fate head-on. Their interactions with other characters, like Ian and Lord John, suggest that they might be separated for some time in Season 7 Part 2, advancing the story in new directions. Meanwhile, Brianna appears to be dealing with the aftermath of her son's kidnapping, although her exact role in the ongoing plot remains unclear. As the series continues to adapt more elements from Diana Gabaldon's books, it's clear that Outlander is moving rapidly towards its conclusion, which will occur in Season 8. However, Claire and Jamie first need to navigate through their ongoing war, a task that will undoubtedly be fraught with challenges as their lives grow increasingly complex. With numerous twists and turns still to come, there are bound to be many obstacles in their path to the happy ending they long for. Now, with that context, let's dive into what we know about the upcoming Season 8, and its prequel series, Outlander Blood of My Blood. As well as showing off the first images for Season 7 Part 2 of Outlander, Stars has also released an exciting first look at Outlander Blood of My Blood, the upcoming prequel series that dives into the backstories of some of the beloved characters from the Outlander universe. Set in two different time periods, the 10-episode first season is currently in production in Scotland and is slated to air in 2025. Outlander Blood of My Blood explores the lives and relationships of Claire's parents, Henry Beauchamp, played by Jeremy Irvine, and Julia Morriston, played by Hermione Corfield, in World War I-era England, and Jamie's parents, Brian Fraser and Ellen Mackenzie, in the early 18th century Scottish Highlands. The prequel series will center on these parallel love stories, shedding light on the origins of the characters who have captivated fans for years. So who is behind the Outlander prequel? It's none other than Matthew B. Roberts, who serves as showrunner and executive producer on both Outlander and Outlander Blood of My Blood. He is joined by Ronald D. Moore, Meryl Davis, and Jim Kohlberg as executive producers. Moore and Davis developed Outlander for television under their production banner, Tall Ship Productions. The prequel series is produced by Tall Ship Productions, Story Mining and Supply Company, and Sony Pictures Television, and will be available across all stars platforms in the US and Canada. The new series aims to deliver the same rich storytelling and complex character dynamics that have made Outlander such a worldwide success. By exploring the early lives of Claire and Jamie's parents, Blood of My Blood is expected to deepen the lore and emotional resonance of the Outlander universe. Fans of the series can expect to see how the experiences and relationships of the older generation shape the lives of their children, adding new layers to the epic saga. As production continues in Scotland, anticipation builds for this latest addition to the Outlander franchise. With its blend of historical drama, romance, and adventure, Outlander Blood of My Blood is set to be another compelling chapter in the beloved series. Furthermore, with stars confirming that seasons 7 and 8 will bring Claire and Jamie's love story to an epic conclusion, it's safe to say that Katrina Balfe and Sam Hewen will return to play fan-favorite Outlander characters Claire and Jamie Fraser. Since season 8 will focus on Gabaldon's ninth book, Go Tell the Bees That I'm Gone, viewers should also expect to see Sophie Skelton's Brianna and Richard Rankin's Roger as they are instrumental to the plot. Conversely, Tobias Menzies has confirmed he won't return as Jack in Season 8. 
It's been an incredible journey, Sam Hewen, who plays Jamie Frazier, shared in an interview with Stars. Katrina Balfe, who plays Claire, added, We hope we do you proud. John Bell, who plays young Ian, chimed in, We're going to go out with a bang and tell the story the way it should be. Outlander's Season 7 Part 2 is set to premiere on Stars on November 22nd, with new episodes available weekly on Fridays at midnight Eastern via the official network app and on demand. Via Linear, new episodes will be released at 8 p.m. Eastern in the U.S. In anticipation of the new episodes, six new photos reveal Claire, Jamie and the gang returning to Scotland for the first time since Season 3. Although not a lot of details about Outlander Season 8 have been confirmed, Diana Gabaldon did reveal that the final season will focus mainly on her ninth book, Go Tell the Bees That I'm Gone. In that novel, Jamie and Claire's relationship is thrown into turmoil once again, as the American Revolutionary War threatens to tear them and their family apart. The American Revolutionary War serves as a volatile backdrop for the Frasers. Jamie's struggle as a soldier and Claire's precarious position as a healer in a war-torn land are central to the narrative. Their resilience and unwavering love for each other are tested repeatedly as they navigate the chaos and uncertainty of the war. The stakes are higher than ever, and their survival hinges on their ability to stay united and strong in the face of relentless adversity. Rob Cameron, who caused significant chaos for Brianna, Roger and their family in the 20th century, continues to cast a long shadow over their lives. Go Tell the Bees I'm Gone delves further into the worries and fears that more conspiracists will try to track them down. The threat of these antagonists loom large, adding a layer of tension and suspense to the story. Brianna and Roger's struggles with these conspiracies highlight the enduring impact of the past on their present lives creating a compelling narrative thread that keeps viewers on the edge of their seats. Given how Season 7 has set the stage with these plot lines, it's likely that Season 8 will dive deeper into these major points. The show has taken some artistic liberties in the past, so it will be interesting to see how closely the final season adheres to the book. Regardless, the core themes of love, survival, and the fight for freedom are expected to remain intact, driving the story to its anticipated epic conclusion. Season 8 is shaping up to be a fitting end to the series, promising to deliver the emotional highs and lows that have become a hallmark of Outlander. The final season will bring closure to the long-standing story arcs while potentially introducing new elements that could pave the way for future stories within the Outlander universe. With the prequel series Outlander Blood of My Blood also on the horizon, fans have much to look forward to as the rich and expansive world created by Diana Gabaldon continues to evolve and expand. And that's that for today's video. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next one. Your suggestions for future videos are always welcome in the comments below. What are your predictions for Claire and Jamie in the final season? Let us know!